Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends, but waiting just around the bend. Gamecock TV. We hope you had a good five day weekend. Today's Wednesday, September 22nd. I'm Brianna. And I'm Alex. And uh, I just want to give a, we just want to give a big congratulations to the band and cheer at New Brock. And they won a band and cheer of the week. So if you see one of them in the hallway, just congratulate them. Now, let's go over to sports. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Clay back with the sports. I'm joined by Julian. And uh, Julian, I heard we got a special guest today. Who do you think it is? Um, I think it might be Gordy. What's up, guys? Yeah. What up, bro? What up, my boy? All right, so Julian, what do we got going on this week with volleyball? All right, so today we have a game, home versus Pike County. Be there. And also Thursday, we play Goshen, home. You should be there, too. And Gordy, what about that cross-country? Cross-country, man. Thursday, we have a, a cross-country meet at Providence, so be there. All right, and then to end off the week, Friday, we got a home game against W.S. Neal, starting at 7 at Bates. Be there. Yes, sir. What's up, guys? It's Gordon. I'm finally back with my boy Sean today, back with your favorite segment of the week, Important Events. What's our What's our first important event All today? All right, so uh, today, only one thing going on, seniors. We have a uh, Balfour meeting at the stadium at 8.30. That's all I have for Tuesday. Now, tomorrow we have a uh, SGA class election, so, you know, go vote. You know what they tell you? Go vote. Go vote. Because if you vote for the wrong person and you don't get it right, you're going to be upset. But go vote. Vote for who you want. America. Vote. Well, uh, that's all we got for today. Uh, Send it back to the host. Yeah, see you guys. Wait a minute. Let's see what Mr. Gordon's got going on. Okay, so we have the quail eggs. I uh, went and picked those up yesterday, and we've been keeping them at room temperature. Turn the pointing end down, and we've got enough to put 120 eggs in here. So, uh, and you see that egg that just went in, it's not we may take it out and clean it again. So we've got enough to do a couple of incubators full of eggs.
Patrice. And Abigail. And you already know we back for lunch. Today we're having a turkey and cheese wrap, shredded lettuce, sweet potato fries, and whole kernel corn, and fruit. And tomorrow we have having spaghetti, green beans, Italian salad, bread sticks, and fruit. Don't forget to get your lunch in the cab. Uh, greetings, Gamecocks. I'm Aiden, and this is my co-host, Faye Blackman, and this is Word Slash Quote of the Day. Now, Aiden, what's our word of the, of the day today? Today's word is imminent, but I can't remember which one. Jordan? Um, is it the E-M-I-N-A-N-T? What does that mean? It's used to emphasize the presence of a positive quality. Mm -hmm. No, I don't think that's the one. Blake? Or is it I-M-M-I-N-E-N-T? What does Something's that mean? about to happen. Oh, okay. Okay, but I think it's mine, which is I M M A N E N T, which just means existing or going like through something. Uh, oh, I remembered it. It's M N A N T. E M A N A N T, which means flowing from. It's the superlative adjective form of emanating. Thanks, guys. Now back to our host, Brianna and Alex. Thanks, Aiden and Bailey. Now let's go over the fun facts. Hey Game Club, it's Fun Facts with Jordan and Bailey. And today we have a special guest. We have Blake. All right, I have some fun facts. Since we were out for school for the hurricane, Hurricane Sally, some fun facts. Did you know that every second a large hurricane releases the energy of 10 atomic bombs? 10? 10. Whew. Hurricanes can even produce tornadoes. A hurricane that we know of is Katrina, and that released up to 33 tornadoes. Oh! oh. Not, yeah, that's crazy. Um, Blake, what did you do when we were out for the hurricane? Sleep. Sleep. I did too. I did too. Did you lose oh. power? Yes. I that's why I slept. I actually didn't lose power. I didn't lose power at all. But some trees were a little... Yeah. yeah. I have a bunker. Anyways, now that we're talking about weather, let's send it to weather with Taylor and Lauren. Thanks guys, and welcome back to weather. We hope everybody stayed safe last week during the hurricane. And this week it's going to be a little chilly. On Tuesday, it's cloudy with a high of 77 and a low of 62. And on Wednesday, it's cloudy with a high of 79 and a low of 64. All right, we're going to send it to Song of the Week. Welcome back, Gamecocks. And this is Song of the Week. This is we're doing a country theme. And Sarah, do you want to start it off with the song? So for the songs we have, I Told You So, Randy Travis, Good Directions by Billy Farrington, You Belong With Me by Taylor Swift, and Something in the Water, Carrie Underwood. See you later, Gamecocks. Well, that wraps up this episode. We hope you have a great day. And uh, we'll see you Thursday. Hi, I'm Christy Wood with Hometown Lenders, and on behalf of WTBY and Hometown Lenders, we want to present the cheerleaders of the week to the New Brockton Gamecocks. Congratulations. I'm Christy Wood with Hometown Lenders, and on behalf of WTVY and Hometown Lenders, we want to present this week's Band of the Week to the New Brockton High School Marching Band. Congratulations! Attention! Salute! Pledge! I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.